Hi beautiful people, welcome to the channel. So in today's video, I want to show you my hair routine that I believe it's very healthy for few reasons. One of the reasons is I'm done have been doing this routine and I believe in it. <laughs> Two, because it has maintained my hair. My hair is healthy. It's healthy, I can say that. Though not to that place I wish it can be. But I believe it's healthy. Again, I'm done who have been doing my hair for the last close to one and a half years. I've never gone to the salon. I've been washing and doing my hair all by myself. Trust me. <laughs> if you have not you don't believe that, just check out all my videos about my hair tutorials, all that, all that, and when they started, yeah. So in today's video, I wanna show you the steps I take or I carry along to just make sure that I, I take care of my hair, yeah, it's not 100% perfect, yes, because I also feel that some things are missing, but yeah, I believe it's okay, so let's get into it. So I start by putting my hair into individual strand twists, yes, to just make sure that my hair is manageable. After that, I go rinse it with water, pure water first. I'm not going to use shampoo or anything else or any type of soap. I'll just rinse it with water. And then after that, I come and then you're going to use shampoo. So the reason why you need to rinse your hair with water first is to make sure that it has enough moisture. You know, you can just apply shampoo to your hair when it's very dry, honestly. It's not even going to make sense. So you have to just rinse it well. I advise to use warm water, not hot water. I don't advise to use hot water on your natural hair, especially. Personally, I use warm water and then later I'm going to use cold water. So after you do the twist you have something like this you can see they are <laughs> different in numbers yes you can just do what works for you and yeah so after rinsing your hair now it's moist enough now we are going to start applying shampoo the reason i'm not going to be showing the products i'm using here it's because uh, they're not the same the shampoo is different from the conditioner and even the Conditioner is different from, oh, I mean the companies are not the, the company is not the same. So that's why I decided I'm not going to show the product like I used to before because I don't want to believe like this this company has these products that are not good and all those. And do you understand what I mean? So after the shampoo, you rinse it out. Then I'm going to deep condition that. And how I do that, I'll start by detangling my hair yes you can see first i'm using my fingers and because they can't go through <laughs> as they should first i take my comb i'm using my afro comb yeah you make sure and then you have to detangle your hair from the from the hair from the ends not from the root that is yeah yeah then i apply the conditioner i tend to apply the conditioner from the edges again not the roots because i believe the conditioners can clog the hair pulls and all that you know they're important so that's why i do that yeah even for the ribbon conditioner i use the same method so i'm going to detangle that i use the comb and then after that i'm going to use my fingers and if my fingers can go through i'm sure that my hair is well detangled and then i'm going to leave that part and do the same to the rest of the hair yes yeah so after i'm done i'll just put my hair into braids you can you can just decide to deep condition with that trip by just putting on your your shower cap or whatever you're using others use steam 
I don't remember it's called steam wash. <laughs> but you can use a shower cup. Person I'll be using a shower cup. So I put that into different braids or twists. Whatever it's, you are comfortable with. And then I just leave it to deep condition for 30 minutes or so. For mine, I left it for 30 minutes. And that's what I usually do. Sometimes I just do it even for an hour. As I go about in my normal the activities after deep conditioning it. So at this point my hair is very clean and it feels so nice believe me <laughs> and the reason why i'm not using a towel to squeeze that water i feel that towels sometimes they dry our hair so much and we don't want to do that so i advise you something else i'm using a cotton leso or sugar whatever you call it you can even use an old t-shirt or even a t-shirt yeah because that is not a towel towel tend to just dry our hair in a way that i don't love it yeah so after that i will just detangle my hair again yes you see it's easy to detangle because of the deep conditioning that i was using i've done i mean and yeah our hair looks so so nice and shrinking is real guys <laughs> My hair has really shrunk in it. Wow. Anyway, it's not bad. <laughs> As it seems, it is stretch again. So again, I'm going to be dividing my hair to just... This time I'm going to be doing braids, individual braids, because that's what I'm going to be sleeping with. Because I'm doing this style at night, honestly. It's around 11 p.m. Yeah. So that's what I'm going to be sleeping with. Uh, sleeping in the sleeping or sleep over whatever it means yeah so i applied the deep conditioner again i apply that from the edges going to the root because i don't want to clog my hair pores yeah someone will ask me why not apply oil why not apply treatment that one will come later but when i do my hair routine especially like now it's at night i'm not I'm not using any oil. I just use the leave-in conditioner. At the end, you see me when I apply my treatment. Yeah, my leave-in treatment. Yeah, I do all those steps because you know you can lose your hair. Yes, especially for me now. I'm facing postpartum hair loss <laughs> from various parts of my head. Maybe the edges, but they're not as bad as I always see others. Yeah, I believe they are better. <laughs> yeah, so. You can see my hair looks so healthy. Yeah, just shrunken, but still, it is okay. It's manageable. So now, after doing the braids, you have something like this. Your whole head. So you can decide to even do smaller braids or even larger braids. Just depending with your length, the length of your hair yeah and it looks so so fresh yeah so that's it it looked so calm in this video especially this part i was so happy yeah so after that i'm going to be using my living treatment i don't know why on other showed this <laughs> <laughs> but it's okay i think living products are different for me yeah so i'm using the sleek living treatment sleek company do have good products honestly i've used their shampoo i've used their conditioner before so but now i'm just using their living treatment yeah and for you have seen for the living condition i'm using the can too i guess that's open i've already shown that because it's it moisturizes my hair because it has oils in it shea butter all that yeah and for the treatment i mainly apply it on the edges along the edges and 
yeah i'm not so careful when it comes to treatment <laughs> the whole head just along the edges you know the best part of all this of this routine is where i massage my head oh jesus this chap it's just the best step you feel relaxed again it's important to massage your head because you are going to allow adequate blood flow in your whatever nerves or whatever <laughs> the hair for you cause and your hair is going to grow well so these are some of the secrets you may decide to ignore but yeah they're important so we massage that even for 30 minutes sometimes Sometimes I let my husband do that for me, but not as often. Maybe once in a few months. <laughs> yeah, so that's it. You enjoy. Yeah. And after that, you just head on to sleep and sleep well. Just not you don't sleep bare head just like that. You have to try something if you have a bonnet, hair bonnet or something like this. A satin head wrap like mine. You see, the following morning my hair looks so so healthy. And I was heading to the salon. I needed to do a trim for the first time. For after so long, I was going to the salon honestly. So I headed to the salon. I did a trim and did this twist, and I'm loving them. Though I feel like. I look funny in short, short twist, but I had to do a trim because my hair needs to be healthy again. So I'm taking these steps to start taking good care of my hair. Yes, guys. So you, if you keep up to this point, all the best in your hair journey. And thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe and like this video.